Okay, so here's a quick look at the new Glam add-on pack for CinePunch. When you download this pack, you're going to see well over 100 different overlays. And in this case, I'm just going to double-click on one of the Glam overlays and get to a point of activity with the glitter. Um, it's about here. I'm going to make an in point, play down, make an out point, and I'm going to drag and drop and place this over my footage. And you may, depending on your project, want to right click and scale to frame size. All right, so the next step, we're just going to go into our effects control pad, go to blending, and change our blending mode to add. And now you can see that the uh, glam overlay is just uh, overlooking our footage now. And you can stack these up to get different types of uh, looks and effects. I'm just going to add another one here. Scroll over. Right about there. Make an endpoint. Make an out point. Drag and drop. Stack this over. And you can see that you can really spread this across uh, a lot of different shots. So in some cases you have uh, 20, 30, 40 seconds. Just going to scale this down. Again, go to blending mode. Change it to add. You can see I'm just stacking a variety of uh, glam overlays and you're just going to kind of get different looks. Okay, so when using the red footage, you're going to have a little bit more flexibility on your color control. So in this case, I'm going to do the same process. going to make an in point, go ahead and make an out point, drag and drop, lay over my footage. I'm going to highlight my shot. And I'm going to go uh, scale this to frame size and then I'm going to with my footage highlighted go over to the effects control panel and right next to that you're going to see the master control panel for red cine and you can scroll down and you can see you have all different options here where I can bump up the I ISO um, and then I can just play around with the uh, shadows and saturation so scroll down here and just uh, crunch the blacks a little bit and just gonna come over here and move up the saturation some more and just plug it right there go too far bump that down and when I'm done I'm just going to again change the blending mode to add and just going to extend this over my footage the same way. I'm just going to grab one more shot, double click, make an in point, out point, drag and drop that, overlay it over my footage, and again, try stacking these. But again, with red, you have this master control panel for red cine. It's really going to give you just a lot more control over your uh, exposures, your uh, saturations, your tint. So go ahead and just play around, experiment with that, and enjoy. Enjoy.